Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to this new green light shooting vlog. So this is a holiday weekend. It's Memorial Day weekend. So I hope you guys are out there enjoying yourselves, camping, fishing, whatever it is. Uh, and as always, make sure you're not forgetting the true meaning of this weekend. So thank you so much to those of you who are out there serving in our military, who have served, who will serve. Uh, it just means so much to us. Um, so thank you and uh, yeah, thank you to all those who have given their life for that. So moving on to this vlog, um, this is exciting because this is the last vlog that I'm going to be doing in this apartment. Next Sunday, I'll be in the house. So that's super, super exciting. But okay, so um, I just wanted to make a real quick video. Uh, I know you guys are out camping, fishing, like I said, so <laughs> you got better things to do. But I, I thought it'd be fun to just talk about uh, my everyday carry. So the stuff that I carry with me every single day. Um, so yeah, man, let's just, let's just dive into it and see what we got. All right, so we've got everything laid out here. So first and foremost is a nice watch. I think, uh, you know, any self-respecting man should have a nice watch up here. So this one's a Hugo Boss one. I really love this watch. My mom got it for me when I graduated college. So I've got three or four other ones, but uh, yeah, I really like this one. So next up, um, we just got my wallet. So the thing about this wallet is, is uh, you know, it's super, super thin. I, I don't like to carry a lot of excess stuff with me. So just really simple, you know, driver's license, concealed carry, uh, you know, credit cards, just stuff like that. So really, really simple. Next up, uh, we've just got my phone. Yeah, I'm an Apple guy, so we've got the, the uh, iPhone here with the cool wooden camera case. And uh, of course, some Burt's Bees. That stuff is a, a lifesaver. Now let's get into a little bit more interesting stuff. So this right here is a flashlight. This is my pocket flashlight. I love this thing. As you can tell, it's about the same size as that chapstick. Um, so I carry it with me every single day. And it seriously, it comes in so much handy. You never realize how often you need a flashlight until you've got one. I use this thing seriously probably daily. Um, so it's a four sevens, that's the brand. And the model, I think you can see right there, it's a mini ML. So it runs off a CR123 battery, I think. Um, super powerful. So back here, it's just got a twist. So if you twist it once, the light comes on, twist it twice, comes on even brighter, and twist it three times, it comes on like super bright. <laughs> it's also got like SOS and stuff like that, but it's just super useful. You know, I'll be hanging out with friends or whatever, and they'll always be like, hey, dude, you got your flashlight on you? Because it's just, uh, you know, it's, it's a nice thing to have. So, um, I do want to say, by the way, so with the uh, the website, the greenlightshooting.com, I want to start reviewing these things. So, you know, I'm going to start picking up some more like pocket flashlights, stuff like that, and just doing reviews on them and let you guys know what I think of them, how they carry, how expensive they are, stuff like that. By the way, that one's like under 40 bucks. So it's a super great buy. Really, really durable. I've had it for years. Okay, so moving on is a pocket knife. I think, you know, if you're, again, if you're a self-respecting man, you should carry a pocket knife. These things come in so much handy. They're always, there's... Yeah, I don't even know, man. I, I couldn't go a day without this thing. I use it every single day. So this one is, I think it's a Sheffield. Yeah, so I got this one as a gift from uh, Trisha's brother for Christmas last last Christmas. So shout out to him. Thanks for this, man. Um, but yeah, it's it's a, you know, a knife is just something that comes in so much handy. I've had an awful lot of knives in my life. <laughs> the first one I had was a, it was a Benchmark Grip and Trisha got it for me for one of our very first anniversaries and I loved that knife. It was a really expensive knife, really, really nice. Unfortunately, I lost it in Hawaii. <laughs> so uh, I got a Kershaw Leak knife. I really like that one. Super crazy sharp out of the factory. I love that thing. Unfortunately, I lost that on a trip to Montana. <laughs> so I stopped buying expensive knives. Um, you know, I just got a cheap kind of replacement knife and then luckily uh, Trisha's brother got me that one. So I think knives are just an awesome thing to always have on hand. Um, so yeah, man, uh, same thing with uh, as those with the flashlights. You know, I'd like to start getting more and doing reviews on the website and stuff like that. So be looking for that. Um, and then last but not least, of course, is the carry gun. So you guys have seen a lot of stuff on this. This is my Springfield XDS 45. Um, I love this thing. I carry it all the time with me. And then it sits in this Galco holster. Um, it's an inside the pant leather holster. I think they call it the tuck and go, Galco tuck and go. Um, so it just sits, you know, uh, inside your pant and you can tuck your shirt in right there. Again, like I've said in other videos, I've never really done that because it doesn't really work that well. But I want to throw it on right now. I'm going to throw this gun on so you can see how it fits on me. Um, you can kind of see the print and uh, just, you know, just, just see how the gun works for me. So let me throw it on real quick and I'll show you that. All right, guys. So hopefully you can see me. I'm going to stand up. I've got the gun on so you can see kind of how it prints and stuff like that. So, all right. So check this out. Um, I've got it on my right hip right here. Um, this is kind of a tighter shirt, so it's, you know, might be printing just a little bit more than normal. But I've got it right back here. If you can tell, if you can see it right there. I don't have the belt on today, but normally that belt would go right on top of that and hold that down. Um, so it's really comfortable right there, and the reason I wear it kind of behind my hip is I just find it's a lot more comfortable, you know. I've tried carrying it right on my hip, 
and it just kind of tends to hit against my bone or whatever. Um, if I try and, and carry it like up in front, like on the appendix carrier or whatever, and I sit down, I notice that the gun kind of jabs into my stomach. So I didn't like that. If I've got it back kind of behind where I've got it right here, when I sit down to drive or just sit down in a chair or whatever, the gun kind of pushes away from my body so it doesn't jab into anything. And it's, it's really comfortable and it's a really easy draw. I mean, you come up right here and you're, you're up. I mean, it's a super easy draw. So yeah, man, that's, a, that's my everyday carry. We've got watch, wallet, phone, uh, chapstick, flashlight, knife, and gun. So super simple video, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, if you guys do enjoy these vlogs, as always, please like them, share them, comment. If you have other ideas for what you'd like to see in vlogs, please leave them in the comments below. Shoot me an email. You know where to find me, greenlightshooting at gmail.com. Head over to the website at greenlightshooting.com. There's a contact form there as well. So, yeah, guys, thanks so much for watching. If you haven't seen these other two videos, please check them out. And we will see you next week from my new house on Sunday for the new vlog. Thanks for watching. <laughs>